Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are gonna learn about remap function, which is one of the most useful and important function in OpenCV library. Uh, I will uh, try to explain this with an example of code also in C++ part. And to simply define uh, what remap is that uh, it's, uh, it's taking an input image and relocating the pixels of that image uh, to the desired image. So it's just changing the pixel replace the placements and creating a new desired image. Uh, the documentation defined it as it applies a generic geometrical transformation to an image. In here also there are some explanation about the logic and what it's taking and what it's giving is that it's taking a source image and destination image. A destination image need to be the same type of the source image but the size can be different but the sizes of the destination image need to be the equal to map1 and map2. Uh, map1 in other words we are also called that uh, we are also calling that map x and map2 we are calling also map y y is like that in the desired image in the destination image map1 in other words map x is including the x coordinates and map2 is including the y coordinates of the desired image you will more clearly understand in the code part and here interpolation and border mode uh, is not really important okay they are important but not really important in here i will use the default ones uh, in here the default ones is interlinear and in here the border default is the default one if the people are really curious about what they are doing they can also check what they are meaning uh, okay let's see the example in the code part uh, I already created a code snap to understand more clearly not to spend time also I already created in here uh, is taking an image uh, which in my side dolphin image is taking then this is the destination image same size type of the source image and sizes also I made a doll equal but destination size does not need to be equal to the source size uh, but for this case, I just made a doll equal. Map X also uh, here they are said they can't be one of these one of these the types I made since both uh, including float type, so I made a doll float type. Then after that, uh, in here I'm creating my map X and map Y, and after that here the remap function I'm doing and here normally you don't need to im show map x and map y but i'm just converting them to understand more clearly what our outputs are meaning okay let's run the code for first of all these are map x and map y and this is output in output i just flipped right normally this is a flip operation but i'm doing that with remap function how i am doing that uh in in this part uh, pixel by pixel in the map X and map Y since bo both of them at the beginning at all all of the pixels is equal to zero in here I am lo uh, changing their pixel as this for example the beginning of the pixels uh, I'm just giving them at the end of the columns pixels and it's continue goes like that to understand more clearly uh, in this order for example going like that the this pixel in the desired image i'm making this pixel so it's just flipping but what's the relation with remap and remap map x remap this is the map x and this is the map y okay any place let's zoom uh, maybe little this part zoom okay and here uh, these are need to be same coordinates let's say this coordinates uh, from here you can check by the way 593 and 287 uh, to remember let's make it more clear coordinates okay 600 uh, this part you will understand what this function doing is 
okay 600 and 300 let's go the same place in here 600 and 300 or below maybe Six hundred go up. Okay. Okay, here. This is six hundred and third hundred three hundred location, which is two hundred forty six. And in the here six hundred okay. This is the other location. 600 and 300. X is 600. Y is 300. This is the input. This is a little complicated to understand this part, but this part very important. 600 and 300. Go right. And 300. Okay, this one. Uh, this is uh, to remember. Maybe we can come here again. Let's make it here. This is right. Let's put it to the corner. <laughs> Not forget. This is 600 and 300. And it's saying to us now this port, this point is very important. Okay. 246 in the Y map. 246 in the Y map. And 128 in the X map. 128, 200. <laughs> sorry, I'm sometimes missing. 240X and 128. Go to the desired image. 128 uh, and 200 okay should be here 128 uh, 128 and 246 okay this one 128 200 for let's put here okay as you can see here in the desired image and here in the in the input image as you can see both pixel values are same this is what i mean okay let's make it summarize again what we did in map x we have coordinates and we went a coordinate random coordinates and this is same for all of the pixels we went 600 300 and 600 300 in here okay this one sorry this and this we went these same points in map x and map y still missing okay this one. in the corner in the corner after going these pixels, the map X and map Y saying go to the 128 pixel in the desired image, 246 pixel in the Y axis in the desired image, and put the <laughs> put the in the put in the input image the 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 300 pixel coordinates in the desired image. Okay, still complicated, but if you playback and what I'm showing is I think it's very clear what remap is doing map X and map Y just including the coordinates not about the RGB values just copying from the input image the RGB values uh, this video may be a little longer but maybe one more example I can give uh, if you want to change the location with the mm, you can cutting this is just flipping but this, ca this function can be used in many uh, for doing many things such as calibration or uh, resizing or others 
Uh, let me show one more. Do this only um, if let's put if here is smaller than let's say 300 and j is smaller than 300 also okay this is wrong and see the result uh, you see that uh, this is only creating this part and the rest is at all in this color because we didn't define this part they are 0 0 and if you go in the input image 0 to 0 pixel and you will see let's see together okay when you check this part uh, okay this value rgb value is equal to all of in here you can check here all of the empty part is equal to 0 to 0 because we didn't define and the map x and map y are defined as 0 in the beginning so it takes at all as 0 and going to 0 pixel taking this value and putting at all in the desired image uh, this is what remap actually doing is just relocating the pixels what you are giving and map x and map y you understood the usage of it okay maybe in the next videos uh, maybe in the calibration I am planning to make a calibration project maybe in there we use this remap again and you understand more clearly uh, see you for this video